we felt like we needed to get the word out in a different way. And so we wanted to invite people from the community to come in and, and have a fun way of learning about what this, what this experience is like for our clients. Um, and so that was the genesis of it all. And the idea of road trip was just such a fun kind of a theme. They'll start at our grocery store, which will be our local convenience store, because oftentimes families don't get the opportunity to go to their local grocery store. They'll also get to experience what it's like to ride public transportation with all of your babies and groceries. It's just to travel uh, two hours and 14 minutes each way to work. And not only that, but she can't use public transport the whole way. She has to use public transport and Uber each way. So, I mean, it's quite an eye opener. They'll also get to experience how people are taken advantage of at your local mechanic shop from shady car dealerships. At least I'm not paying 27% for my brakes, you know, and having to come back and pay weekly because I can't pay it all at once. And just those extra huge fees that come with, for instance, shopping at a convenience store versus a grocery store. And, you know, the prices are double, but it's that or ride the bus an hour to a grocery store. And then they'll also get to see the solution to all of these pitfalls and how we play a role in making sure that families aren't taken advantage of. I've known on the road lending for a long time, but going through the, the little, um, what I call the hardship tour was very eye-opening. The number one reason people lose their jobs is lack of dependable transportation. So this is what we're trying to do, help families get better transportation, have better, better cars and better lives. Taking the back roads all the way down to Mexico And I'm winding up in a hill country town I don't know where I'll be going Baby Tonight is an exciting night for the mission of On the Road Lending. I really appreciate everyone going through our stations and hopefully having a little fun with it. When we handed the, the little babies and the strollers to the women as they came in, they, they lighted up and thought this would be fun, and I saw all the guys look desperately for where the bar was. So, Seeing my wife with the new baby at age 67 is like, flip my lid. I guess we're going to have to start saving for college tonight. I know this was not your typical fundraising dinner. Um, we wanted you to just have some fun and experience what all this is about. For those of you that are new to what our organization is all about, um, I hope that you'll consider joining us in, in this march towards trying to help our uh, brothers and sisters in our community. I'm a client, so it was a reminder of carrying the groceries on the bus with the kids, with the baby. So given the, the opportunity that they gave me to provide a car for me, a big blessing.